The reason, what is the date? 12, holy fuck. Uh, the reason we're starting on the 12th for the year of the videos is because I wanted to lock in the goals and the, I don't know what this hand motion is. The goals and things of the uh, goal, what do you call these? News resolutions. So firstly, we have last year's diary, which has last year's goals and resolutions in them, which we shall cover first. I didn't, I don't, I didn't do great. I didn't, I didn't, I've assigned, I've assigned point values. I haven't actually added them up. We can, we can add them up now. 14 points total, and we reached, uh, six. We got, we got, we got six out of 14. It's not great. I'm going to be honest. Now, that we're, if you remember, we did this video. Did it, did it. Like a year ago, Dylan. I don't know the exact date we put up the one last year. Probably around the same time. Probably around the same time. Now, they're separated into one, two, three, four, five categories. You've got personal, Viva La Deal, books, film and TV, and then games. One, two, three, four. That is five. Oh, my God. Can't count. We'll start at personal. 10K in under an hour. Point. Uh, the biggest I did was... Uh, like 11k at whatever one hour like it was it I can't remember exactly the app doesn't save them that far there was uh, it was in Shepparton because just all flat paths it was fucking amazing I took off from Kieran's place one morning at Shepparton in one direction pretty sure I went to the next town I was like fucking making good pace and you know why no fucking hills where I am Fucking hills everywhere. Hills and hills and hills. Shepparton. Just, it was just, it was just fucking smooth sailing. It was just like, it was great. It was fantastic. Great. Amazing. Loved it. It was great. Cook more. Fast food, freezer food less. 0.5 because we didn't really cook more. That went to ship very quickly after we moved into this house. Um, after I moved out of my house. That went to, that kind of just went down. Fast food, freezer food less. That's, basically non-existent I, I cook freezer food for like I mean I was I was having a lot of freezer food especially uh, towards the end of, towards the end of 2016 a lot of freezer food uh, more social get out with current and old friends more also meet new people if you've been watching the vlog no explanation needed point get out of comfort zone more if you've been watching the vlog no explanation needed Point. Leave petrol. No, still there. Still there. Move out in brackets. Again. Don't let depression and anxiety rule life. Point five. Because way better. Like ten tenfolds better than 2016. 2017 wasn't perfect though. And you know what? Given that I've spent the first six to eight years in the, the predicaments, point, point five. Cook 20 things I haven't before. Zero points. Like I, I barely got halfway. I wasn't counting, but I'm pretty sure I barely got halfway. So overall, personal, we got, we got fucking shit. We did shit. We did shit. Dude, we didn't do great. Viva La Deal. Once funds aren't tight, one movie review a week. Zero points. We wouldn't, we weren't even close to one movie review. Regular uploads continue vlog 100. Or number, uh, yes, point. Books. Goodreads challenge 30 books. I made it to 28. Zero points. Film and TV. Watch 100 new movies. I made it to 86 or something like that. Zero points. Watch everything on AFI Top 100 list. In brackets. Stuff of that I haven't seen before. Zero points. I didn't... I... I... I not once did I open the AFI Top 100 list in the whole fucking year. That's terrible. Games. Reach 100... 111 Platinums. I can't remember why I, ch I chose this number, but yes, I reached 111. I got... I got to 120 by the end of the year. Point. Uh, so that's 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 uh, that's that's that. That is there's there's no more. That was that's uh, 2016. We can now officially retire this thing. It's fine. This year, look at the hot pink diary I got. I was like, I had black last year. I'm gonna step up our game. It's gonna be beautiful this year. It's gonna be amazing. Let's go back to this one. This year, I was like, we need to settle down. Maybe not set as many because last year random things happened that you know I could. It's just like not everything. It's it's you can't. 2018 goals. Are you ready to settle in? That not actually that. That's not fine. Which just let me say the fuck. Personal move in brackets. 
full stop. I don't care where, just out of this house would be good. Okay, thank you, thank you. Full Number two, cook 20 new things, hashtag Dylan's 20 new foods. Put this one back on because I was disappointed I didn't do it and I was like, you know what, that is something I can just, I still w would like to set as a goal book to motivate me to cook new things. Um, so cook, cook 20 new things. Now the hashtag I'm gonna use when I upload, because I upload the picture of it to Instagram, and then that way I can actually track. I could just write on my phone, not as exciting. This way, hashtag Dylan's 20, 20 new foods, Instagram, that will be working towards that goal. We, of course, uh, 12 days in, haven't started. It's fine, we've got, we got, we got millions of days left. Uh, and the third thing uh, was, I, need, I didn't know what I wanted to do for a physical challenge type thingy. I was like, well, I'm gonna set like, mm, run X amount. Over 407.9 kilometers tracked runs. That's because last year my total number of tracked kilometers run was 407.9. So it's a simple, simple challenge of beat last year's. Simple, do better, get that to do. No, the next camera. Creative slash explosion outlook slash vivo deal slash fucking all that shit. Number one was change because I originally had it written down at two. I've changed it to one. Uh, before doing this video because this is the one thing that's keeping me from doing this video because I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. R one video a week on this channel. Always one video a week. Do more, just minimum of one. I had a minimum of two, however yesterday and the day before when my days of work, I spent both those days, the first day doing five hours of straight podcast editing and the second day doing seven and a half to eight hours of straight podcast editing. And I was like, this is just, just we'll, we'll settle at one. Just to make sure because this is just my fun little hey world and if no one watches it's like hey Dylan you 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 have enjoy watching this are you enjoying watching this when you're doing your montage video at the end of 2018 cool very good that's great number two reach vlog chapter three now this may seem like something it's like oh Dylan you could just reach vlog chapter three now and you just you just make the video and you say it's chapter three new year perfect time you start the third chapter no it doesn't work like that. There are rules to the chapters. The chapters have to be spurred by a monumental life event happening, like something that 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 if this if my life was a book or a TV show would deem another chapter or season break or something like that. And that, and and the year changing does not signify. We need something cool to happen, and we need to end it then. And then we start chapter three. So how do I officially make this chapter happen? by doing cool shit, or having cool shit just magically happen to me. Either way, now of course, the, the way to make it actually happen would be to be like putting in effort to make cool things happen, because you can make it happen. If cool things just fall into my lap, and it's like, ooh, you know, if I won the lotto, well to make that happen, I'd actually have to purchase lotto tickets. Number three, I can actually tick this one off. This was a simple one, and just something I wanted to happen this year, and it did, it's already happened. Number three, get a media pass. We got media passes to RTX. We got an RTX in a couple of weeks. We got a media pass. Cool. It's 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 it is a small sense of self gratification. Yes. I just realised I got the perfect like. Number four. New and approved content. I'm happy to look back on at the end of the year. That that that, that really doesn't have any kind of self defined way to meet it. However. It's like, if I reach the end of the year, read this and go, oh, I did that really cool new show, or I did that really cool new podcast, or any, it could be something else. Maybe I take up painting, and I'm like, oh, you know, remember how I got into that art show? Remember that, that art show? You know, what, you know what I mean? It just has to reach, although the art show ties into number five. Number five is something new and completely different. <laughs> And now for something completely different. Not the Monty Python movie. Quite funny though. End of the year. Look back. Read this. Did I give myself points? If I read this at the end of the year, it goes something new, completely different. And I'm like, remember that time I got to that art show? Point. Remember that time... You know what I mean? Like, just compared to years previous or compared to my usual creative spare time, whatever. What, you know, something new and completely different. It doesn't have a distinctive meaning. It is something I will only officially be sure when it happens, or at the end of the year, or whatever. Number three books. Goodreads Challenge 32 books. 
That is the 30 plus the 2 I missed from last year. Yes, I will fucking make up for it. If I fail it again, we will cry and we'll not probably add the time. Also, clear 20% off... I just read POS. I'm like, what do I even mean by this? It says POS. I'm like, clear 20% off pieces of shit? No, pile of shame. That's what it is. Clear 20% off pile of shame. I currently... Which is 19. So, if I work through a lot of the books I'm already currently reading, because I currently have like 10 books on the go at the same time, that nearly knocks it all off. So, it's like, if I can clear what I'm reading, actually commit to finishing a book, yes. Yes. Film and TV. Watch 108 new movies. Uh, that will, of course, be tracked on track.tv. Track.tv. Sign up. Track your movies and TV shows. One day, I want them to be my first sponsor. It's a dream. Or AK Racing Share, because I need a new share. 108 new movies. That is 100, as per the last two previous years, plus the eight I missed, tacked on, much like the books. Watched everything on the AFY 100 list. I'm, I'm chucking that one back in, like the cooking one, because it's actually something I really want to do, and I'm like, do it. Just, can you fucking do it, though? Cleared 25% of the pile of shame of my Blu-rays and DVDs owned. I own a lot of Blu-rays and DVDs. When I was a young little lad, I wrote quite a lot. A lot of them I haven't even watched yet. Some of them are barely even opened. I don't buy that many these days. Everyone likes to make fun of me like I buy too many. No, if you if we were doing this years ago, no, complete, you would have, you would have been up fucking shit crazy. There was, uh, yeah, which equals 26. So I watched 26 Blu-rays and DVDs I currently own. Clear them. Of course, if I watched on Netflix, I do get to clear the Blu-ray, so that doesn't mean actual watch. Games, and this is the last category. Now this is the, the if you follow me on Twitter, you've already seen this one. Reach 169. Nine. Platinum. Yes, 169. That means I'm going from 120 to 169 in one year. That's quite a lot. We're going to commit. We're going to do it. We're going to we're going to kick some ass. Listen to Platinum Explosion on ExplosionNetwork.com, where I'll be talking about the games that I'm platinuming each and every week. And the last one, finished or in brackets or done with, as in got to a stage where I think like. In my Steam library, I have like completed with slash done with. Because it's like sometimes you're like, I'm not going to finish this game because you, you get like halfway through it and you're like, I fucking hate this game now. And it's just done with it. Stop playing. Finished or done with all PS4 games that I own, hashtag in brackets disc, by end of year. Now I've got in disc because then I may get games from like PS Plus that I don't actually want to play and I don't want to include that. So anything that I buy in 2018... I will have finished, well, the aim is to have finished by end of year, don't have stuff left over. I'm going to give myself a small like a little asterisk on it, if I buy, if a game comes out like early December and it's like a huge game or something and I don't finish it by the end of the year, pass. Other than that, and uh, the challenges and the things and the stuff, thank you so much for watching today's video. It has been great to be here to tell you and to put out all my goals and challenges out into the open world. That's right, one video a week here, other things at ExplosionNetwork.com and other things are on the Twitters and the Instagrams. I don't know if I have links to all these things in my, I never usually try and pimp all the things, but it's like the first video of the year, I feel like you should just be like, can you follow all appropriate social media outlets? Fuck Facebook. You don't need me on Facebook. Twitter, Instagram, vivladeal.com. Don't go there. Explosionnetwork.com. Twitch.tv slash Explosion Network. Subscribe to this channel. Like this video. Like all of last year's videos. Go back, do that. And like all of this year's ones. Thanks. Bring that ass back like a boom, 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 boom.